Yo guys, what's up? What's good? What's happening? Yes, it's your boy uh, Paul Way. I'm talking to your face. I was being this video chilling with me. It's Donny Fesky. Donny Fesky, what's up? <laughs> bro, isn't it pop? My dealer. <laughs> no, you need to change your dealer, bro. <laughs> Mr. Dealer, man. <laughs> hey, you, you're, you're fired, bro. <laughs> what's good, amazing people? My name is Paul Way. I'm super excited to be in front of your faces. Um, I just want to say a big thank you for everything that you do. Thank you for your likes. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for sharing our video for your comments, both the positive and the negative ones, we see them. And we appreciate everything that you do. 100, you 100, Upo, 100, 100, 100, 100. Bruh. <laughs> Straight up, uh, we have Asheke and Shady Vibes in the same year. I think this 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 commercial has been like a long time coming. We are sure have like a long time. Mm. Because the people on the show will not allow us to have peace. Yeah. There's always been a banter between Asheke, Shea vibes. We own Shea vibes. We own Shake. Shake is better. Shake is better. Like that talk has, has never ended. Like ever since but the book came on said everything. But um, for you, uh, could you put you the spot? Let me ask them first. Who do you think is that guy for you on the street? While we're talking about this, let me see, just keep bombing the comment. Let me see what you guys think on who do you, who do you think of all the street lockdown for like for you and everything. Shut up. Let's go to what these guys. I like doing that Shake as a person. So at the point where um uh, for him. Um, I think actually has records that Shea does not have, like sincerely. Uh, so I think actually amounts about two billion career streams on our platform, and it was like about it was 2022, like long, long before, before, like long before the year ended and everything. We saw where he dropped this EP, the first EP he had. We had Trabaye, Sumba, Omope, Baba Gold, and um, um, he did Sumba with the Boy, the remix and everything. And at the time, it was looking like um he owned 2022 we also saw where he said move forward to drop an album mr money with the vibe mm -hmm. which i thought i'm going to organize peace beyond to you to where musha joa nzaza also to reason sumomi and sumari miss which oh, that was born and everything for 2022 it's safe to say ashake on the streets lock the street down do you agree to that well i, I mean what on the street is that ashake held it down and that's the truth i mean a lot of times we want to get into certain arguments and of course we want to you know, speak in favor of our favorite artists. Yeah, and, but I mean, there are facts and figures out there. And then one fact is, Ashoka held it down with banging songs back to back. When he dropped the Lade project, it was it was a no skip project. Yeah, true. No and then he true. dropped the, the he dropped the album, and then of course had a lot of features on it. Even with Ross, he even had um, Burner Boy on the remix of Sumba. You know, which went bonkers. I mean, the numbers were like bonkers on the street. So. It's fair to say that he had it on lock. Um, I mean, there's no debate about that one. No debate about that one. We saw um, for the we saw where he's continuing with his with his runs, and he actually, like like I said, he's only had two things. We saw where he had uh, Mr. Money, Mr. Money with the vibe became the highest charting debut album in Billboard history at the time. Moving on, we saw where Ajake sold about one hundred thousand total album units in the US. Um, Mr. Money with the vibe is the first debut album issue to hit two hundred million streams of boom play. Terminator has now sold over 100 units in the, in the US, uh, 1 billion streams. Um, okay, so it was like, in this the 2 billion, so it was like the first 1 billion streaming platform and everything. Uh, before we go to Ashake, what do you think, um, and before we go to Shea by brother, what, we, what was that thing you think Ashake did properly that made him um, go lock or have the streets of lockdown? One of the things I was also used to say to people is that when you catch a vibe, you stay on that vibe and milk it. That was one thing that Ashake did. Ashake understood that, you know, people loved him. And when he dropped the project, um, I mean, it was like, yo, everybody's feeling me right now. And then this is my opportunity. Ashake has waited all his life, you know, yeah. to actually like seize this moment. And then also signing with YBNL, you know, Olamide taking him under his wings. That was just like a covering for him and some type of like assurance that you, you are in the right, you're in the right path. And then we're also going to give you like a backing to be able to succeed. And once he saw that, he worked super hard, dropped banging back-to-back -back tracks, kept people talking about him on the street, kept people yearning for his music. Ashake had the style of dropping snippets, and then he would drop snippets after a song was just released, like maybe a couple of weeks, and then he's dropping another that snippet, and, yeah. and then he's dropping another snippet. And then people are like, yo, this guy, you know the rest of it. But people loved it because everything that he did was intentional, and the songs were actually very, very, very well chosen. And then... It was just like a continuance. Like I drop one hit, I'm dropping another hit. It was hit after hit. Yeah. So I think 
consistency was one of the things that Ashake did. And, you know, shout out to his team for that amazing yeah, work that they've done team, with yeah. him. And then Ashake's personality is something that is worthy, you know, of, of note and worthy for us to have a conversation about because his, his type of person is like, you know, when you see Ashake, you see a workaholic. And you yeah, know he'll true, never really true, stop. So true. I mean, kudos to him for all that. Yeah, kudos to him from Paul Way. Um, you ended, you, ended, you almost ended when he said um, he he was lucky to be signed with my um, BNL, which was the coverage for him and everything. On the contrary, you have a shady vibe. Who um, a lot of person feel like he didn't have that privilege at the time, more mm-hmm. of himself. And then what of note, she has been like she has been in the game before Shakira and everything. Mm-hmm. OG OG in the game. We saw the point where um, she vibes. Um, had his, had his own run to start with he dropped an album mm. and um bd um be the baby darling we had to me on that one if saru chance now um, and them billion dollar billion band gangster plus two three four ten with my own the bank of america so just was that some people actually had not looked that one which was really well we saw where actually had a um billion dollar baby 2.0 where a lot of people actually stand to play that one and doing good for himself. Also, we saw where he dropped the memory card um, EP again, and we saw Goat Paraboy Alaska, IG Story, Love is War, and um, he had YX Young K. Young K. Amazing. What well, about well, these young street guys who joined him up on that one? Talking about Shibai, we saw where he came through with um, Zatan with LTBI, Let It Be Light. Uh, LTBI, I think that was a song for the um, Bottle Flip Challenge yeah. out there. And yeah. everything but also yeah um talk from the album thing the album took us to this year right people we people get the song from um chance to this year so sorted john america and come through with him in january yeah. where they came through that amazing video where it, from what that coming out and right, everything right right one but then um straight to it 2022 i should get added on lockdown yeah um, she had that amazing run from the album to yeah. the eps yeah. to a little bit light and amazing one do you think he has the potential to? We also saw on Guagalada where he came through with uh, <clears throat> with Cristiano on Guagalada and everything. So it's more like these are the songs that are really trending at the moment. Mm. Do you think she has what it takes to after him during lockdown in the streets? The truth of the matter is, it depends on him because I remember like there was one time where you know Buju Benson had a like freaking run. He had an amazing, amazing run. run yeah. Everybody you know knew about Buju and Buju was on the streets. He was everywhere. He was in you know major collaborations whiskey everybody literally everybody, everybody yeah. boy literally everybody man like yo i feel like that period for him was one type one one really amazing you know period in his life where he i think he didn't really expect it but of course his creativity you know and him that you know that respect and that's those collaborations and you know getting into the studio with you know super alias artists so um you know there's no doubt obviously that Ashake had like an amazing run you know in 2022 yeah. you know also like in the early part of 2023 but right now Ashake is almost being compared to and sorry um, Shaver is almost being compared to an Ashake which is a good thing for his career because everybody really jumped on the Ashake wave and now you have a Shay vibes who's doing bonkers right now in the industry so it's like it's a good thing and also um like some type of weight on his shoulder because um people are expecting so much from him right now so people are not even paying attention to the fact that he's just a separate he's just a different artist with a different style you know might be arguable that they have a close you know um affinity in terms of style yeah. but truth of the matter is they are both different artists and we need to really respect them as that you know, there's 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 too much comparison between Ashake and you know Shea vibes in terms of how they sound. Did they also like bop for the street? The songs are street oriented. You know, it's it's one type of. I don't even want. To, I don't even know how to classify their beat, but it's almost like the same thing. You know, but the, how they bounce off on the beat is just very very genuine, and also the, the way they are styled. They are very stylish. You know, Shea vibes is very style, very very stylish. You know, Ashake is also very stylish as well. So. There's some like close marking where they give each other, but at the end of the day, they are two different artists and they are two different people. And I I, I want to say that I don't think that there's so much pressure on the Shea vibes because at the end of the day, we also definitely like, you know, rock with these art- artists in a different wave wavelength and a different level. True. Asake is amazing, has a street on lockdown. Shea vibes is doing everything right now to be so relevant. I don't think he's doing it with so much pressure because people are the ones looking for him. Yeah, he's true. on different definitely. collaborations. I mean, testament to that is the Guagualada song. Come on, 
Quite come and see now time. like he definitely like eat that shit up man yeah. so i feel like right now the street is yearning for like an ashake he's yearning for a shady vibes i think it's like a 50 50 type of thing but whether he would have an amazing run i think that shady vibes has the potential 100 percent to have a very very super 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 run oh, okay yeah talking about 2023 yeah before i leave this video yeah um um ashake has grown to an extent where um, most of his songs are not only for the streets anymore. Mm -hmm. I've also made songs for the earliest guys, for the mm -hmm. for people in the city, so to say, mm -hmm. such a way that from different walks of life can relate to your songs. Mm -hmm. And um Shay Vibes is still in the streets. Mm -hmm. Do you think for Shay Vibes to match up match up with Ashake, you need to do something in line with that? That's one. Second of the fact that Ashake has numbers mm -hmm. to be not a stream. Shay Vibes doesn't mm -hmm. have that numbers. Mm -hmm. Is that a limitation to Shay Vibes? Too? Shay Vibes is not limited in any ways. Let's get it straight. Like yo, it's it's a journey. Shay Vibes is just like picking right now and then he needs to stay consistent and nobody really understands how these guys move. They are definitely working and they have a plan and I believe that they have a solid management and a team behind them who really will give them the best advice. Now, I, I don't want us to like get over our heads and just try to compare both of them. Ashake has amazing numbers. Yeah, you cannot say the same thing for Shay Vibes but right now he's on his way. He's building. Ashake did not wake up one morning and then have two billion streams yeah, that's true. you know i mean we gave him time we, we were working with him he was steady he was consistent and that's how he grew to the, you know to the point where he is right now and the same thing for shay vibes he's doing his beats he's you know putting out good songs so i mean what else what else do you really want to hear from him though he's working and i believe that he's working really hard so i think that um um, no pressure at all he has everything i mean everything within his belt to actually succeed even way 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 further than we think he would way further than we think it would anyways guys so we we'll come to the end of this one but trust me you're sweet boy i won't be there with asking you guys your thoughts and, and your opinion about what we just talk about as i can actually vibe straight up to you guys point black who do you think is better now i'm not asking you because i know we're not sick to talk about that but i'm asking you who is that person who has all the shit down a lot of shit down for you personally let me see his name in the comment section and i'll tell the person this person said he likes you more that person said he likes you more guys i'll catch you in the next one stay safe blessed and remember be careful Thank you.